Happy farmer right here. Came for a half a gallon, look. One and a half gallons. Welcome to the vlog. Thank you so much for tuning in. An exciting day. I'm gonna take, can't barely talk, she's so excited. Mom is so excited to get back with the calf. We are gonna take you along on the milking. We're gonna harvest milk for ourselves. How are you doing this morning? She's ready. Children's gotta get out of the lane. Art is here. Simeon from the Swedish homestead, all the way from Sweden. You have cows, but you don't have dairy cows, we right? Don't, we don't milk them at the moment. We don't milk them. This is what we did to set up. It's tricky. The calf, I wish the calf would have went in a different stall. Okay. Kids. Uh, not yet. Not yet. Just hold on. I'm going to get in here and get this calf. Yeah. Tie her up. Yeah. It would help. She's, she is. I don't think she has ever been handled before she came here. And she's a little older. She's probably two months old now. Let me. I'll get her out. Pet her a little bit. Okay. Good things happen when I come around. Good things happen. When I come around, you get reunited with your mother. We kept her in the stall just overnight so that mom would build up milk for us. We get morning milk, and then the calf is on mom all day long. All right, you guys open this door. It's gonna, it could get crazy. Other cows in here. Let's open up all stalls. Leave them open. Yeah. And I need my big staff. Jonah, have you seen my big staff? Now, let's get them in there. Okay, guys. Yeah. She's ready to get in. Let's get everybody in. We want their manure deposits. We want the other mama cow to be trained and start getting in the rhythm. We want a, we want a calm stud muffin. Hey, Jonah, can you help us find our chain? I draw off it somewhere. It. You did, you found the oh. chain. All right, what we want is Stud Muffin to go lead the charge. I think he will since he's El Jefe. Come on. Come on, Stud. Show him how it's done, buddy. Come on. We're taming Stud. We're training. We're training Flossie. She'll be in milk soon. She's gonna have a calf February or March. Oh, he don't wanna go, okay. Stud is gonna be. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right, Art. You want to herd on that? Herd them down. I'll get. I'll get Phyllis. She'll set the example, and then they'll all come. Let's get Phyllis in the correct stall. They're new to this, so this is not a smooth rhythm yet. I don't need any of them. Know what we want from them yet? But they're quickly learning. Yeah. It's all right. You got her. Let's get you in a stall. Come on. Come on. Get in a stall. Oh, shoot. I forgot that you can't. Here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. Thank you. Get her to go in that stall. Let's give it a second and we'll get him. Jonah, come hold this gate. Hold on, we're gonna get the bull in in a second. Normally I would not care. The bull could stay out. It's just that we actually wanna grab his tail hairs so that we can test him for what you call an A2A2 genetic, which is a, a milk that's gonna be more digestible from his offspring. The mamas are A2A2. So if he's A2A2, it's a 100% chance their offspring are gonna be A2. A2. If he's A1, A2, there's just a 75% chance, which is not terrible. Hey, he could run back. He has before. So just be careful. Jonah. He will. I want you to get him some hay, though. Oh, wait, wait watch out. He doesn't want to go in there for some reason. Probably a cat or a dog. Are you sure? Probably. 
What is in there? There's nothing in there. He usually just goes right in. Go a little further towards Grace. Hey, stop hitting the... Get back in there. Bear! Stop coming out. Jonah, can you shoo him somehow? There you go. Keep going. Keep coming at him. Oh, man. He's stepping in the manure bucket. All right, there you go. Come on. Come on. Keep coming at him, Jonah. There you go. There you go. Come on. Come on. There we go. Got it. All right. That was quite the event. Now, let's move this calf to the head of the stanchion so they can have each other. Jonah, come put some chaff in here. We got chaff hay ready. Is that good? Up. Yeah, that's good. Sprinkle it on there. You guys pet the calf. The more, the better. She's got to get used to us. She has tiny horns. Oh, she's this drinking. is the only way I know to do it. She has tiny horns. That's okay. If she wants a little apple cider vinegar straight up, she can have it. Milking bucket. That's my bench. I'm about to let mom out. She might try to go under the strand because she's so desperate. Listen, so if she goes under the strand, you guys got to back up. She'll want to get to her calf. Be ready to stand by Jonah. Ready? There we go. Good. Good. Look. Look how smooth. Come on, Mom. You're a good one. Yes! So smooth. Is she bursting his milk? Ooh, let's see. This is exciting. It's pretty clean down there. We're going to see if she's bursting with milk. I'm ready for this. Hey, hopefully we're going to milk, milk, have milk with our breakfast, buddy. That's great. How would that be? That would be super exciting. So she's not too dirty. I'm happy about that. But we're going to clean her anyway. I'm gonna... She's clean. She's ready to go. I'm handing the camera off to a real pro. Art from Art and Marie. Milk and time, guys. Nice. Do you like those bigger teeth? I love these bigger teeth. Oh my gosh. I can get my whole hand around these. Isn't that lovely? Goodbye, tiny teeth. I can uh, barely get a hand in edgewise. <laughs> Man, I'm just I'm just going to town right here. And just look how, how still she is. She's an experienced milker. Hardy is all get out. Has healed her cuts. Has healed her udder. And very minimal for us. How much milk are we gonna get? I would say half a gallon. That's gonna be my guess. Hey, Cat, you think we're only gonna get a half a gallon? That's what I'm gonna guess. It's just, you know, she's nervous. Yeah. She, she hadn't been milked in, what, three, four days by hand? Maybe more with Dan. I don't think they were milking her. They just had the calf on her, right? Yeah, I think they stopped milking her. So, set my expectations low. I'm more concerned with her health, so yeah. if she wants to give me a half a gallon and stay healthy right now, with all the stress, I'll be happy. Do your hands ever not get sore, Art? They always got sore. Yeah. I almost have to squeeze. I'm probably working too hard. I never got to a point where it was just easy. No. Cows don't give milk, do they? <laughs> you gotta fight for every drop. I talked to guys who used to milk 10 cows, like old, old guys. They yeah. milk 10 cows. Okay. <laughs> my grandpa would milk 15 cows a day. That's unreal. And, and, and my grandma would milk, do 10. Imagine said, shaking his hand. Take them all day. <laughs> what? Imagine shaking his hand. <laughs> I know. People were just beasts back then. Yeah, it's unreal. Because it took me 20 minutes to milk one cow, and I thought it was doing pretty good. But if I was to do 15 at that rate, that'd take me forever. Yeah. 
And I said, Pop, how long did that take? And he said, it didn't take them long. So I'm like, all right, I just gotta gird up my loins, man. It's good pan. <laughs> Paul, the inspiration. If I ever complain about having to milk one cow, two cows, I remember Grandpa. It's so amazing. Mm. Sure, grab that teat and go. farmer right here came for a half a gallon look one and a half gallons gosh like that's great to be shaking to hold up this milk this is just like unbelievable we came on out of day. right there yeah you guys <laughs> came on a good day so let's go get this in the cooler let's go filter this get this in the cooler come let them back out and feed them So excited about that milk, yes. Let's get them back out to pasture. Good mama right there, taking care of her cat. Go for it, buddy. Is it good? That's really good. Good. Do you like it? Oh, good. All the kids like it. Oh, you're gonna drink a whole half a gallon between everybody this morning. Good. Good. All right, sir. I'm gonna have you open this yep. cow gate. Mm -hmm. Step muffins in there. Yep. I'm thinking. He comes out. I think I might can hide behind here, be protected from here in case he kicks. Yeah. And grab his tail, Harris, what do you think? Uh, so you just open that door and then just step back. Yeah, are you grabbing his tail fine or? No, I'm grabbing his tail, that's a good question. I'm grabbing, <laughs> just, just to see if I can do, man test. test. No, I'm gonna grab his, I'm gonna grab, pull his tail, oh, tail hairs hair. to test for HUA2 genetics. Get it, you need a hair, you don't, you're not just tugging his tail. Um, yeah. So, you're just gonna open that door and come over here. I think you can do that. You swing it open. Here, you can use the staff. So you build it out. Okay, here we go. No way. 
we're gonna have to get it another way. 